hello everyone welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel my name is eliza at eliza journals so today i'm gonna do a plan with me but i'm black back planning everything um so i'm just showing you a quick overview of how the last three spreads look and what ended up happening was my journals i had to reschedule them because i didn't want my packages to get stolen while i was out of town so what i used to write my notes is transparent sticky notes i actually love these so that's pretty much why you see on the right hand side that it looks like i wrote on my desk but it's actually the transparent sticky notes so i'll be using my fountain pen and i'll be using a marvy i'm sorry that is not i get them mixed up all the time but that is a pentel touch sign pen i absolutely do not recommend using these in a hemlock and oak notebook because the paper is a little bit porous and it did not write smooth at all so the pentel sign touch pens have to be like on smoother paper and although the hemlock and oak is not hard but it's not smooth enough for the pentel touch sign pens so i'm just pretty much just rewriting everything i wrote on my sticky notes inside of my hemlock and oak and to be honest i don't even think i wrote everything that i did in there at all because sometimes you end up just doing more than what you actually plan to do i try not to i try not to do so many things in one day but sometimes i just stay up all night and do it anyway so um on the first I, I didn't even write on the first well actually yes i did but i was going to write it like in big letters but on the first um which was on a sunday i got baptized and if anyone knows me knows that i am christian so that was my first time being baptized as an adult you know because when you're a child you get christening and all that but as an adult i'm 37 and that was my first time getting baptized my mom was out of town at the time she had went out of town and i'm like oh no like i really want you to be there when i get baptized so my mom went out of town because my grandmother was sick so my mom literally surprised me and my grandmother lives in florida so my mom surprised me completely and she came back from florida six hours away to see me get baptized so that really just was like the highlight of my sunday so anyway so moving on to the second what i like to do is i actually like to use pens and markers so that everything doesn't just look like it's just written in pen it's just something about it i just can't write in pen i have to do some brush lettering and just regular handwriting because it just makes it so much fun when you can do both it kind of brings life to the page like i'm really extra so i really just have to just show my creativity and that's how i show my creativity i love lettering and to be honest i absolutely get stuck into lettering things even at my job they will literally come to my office and say hey can you write on this card or can you sign this card or can you write on the board for us they let my director literally order um chalk markers from amazon because every time someone needs me something needs to be written they're like hey can you come write this so uh, it's just like that was like a hidden talent that i really didn't tell anyone about until they actually saw it and they're like who wrote this and i'm like i did and they're like so now it's literally like oh just get eliza to write it she'll write it so i i'm always stuck hand lettering um things at my job are gonna have to forgive me when I went back to edit this video so I'm gonna be real right now um, because I do not do scripted voiceovers I just can't it, it will never work I've tried and every time 
I tried to do like scripted voiceovers, I end up just recording four, five, six, seven times. So if y'all hear me make mistakes, just don't even worry about it. Cause it gets to a point where you're like, I'm not going to keep re 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 recording these voiceovers at all. I'm just going to be 100% real with y'all. But when I went back to look at my video and to edit them, I'm like, gosh, I write really small. And then I noticed that, um, I guess my focus wasn't clear. I don't know if my lens needed to be cleaned off, but it was like, everything seems blurry to me. So forgive me if it looks really blurry to you all. Um, hopefully I can try to fix that next time. I don't know why it was so blurry. I have no idea. One thing I do when I plan, and I'm not sure if y'all do this, let me know in the comment section if y'all do this. I prioritize my tasks according to importance. So, and also in, in according to time. So all my tasks that will take me a limited amount of time, I try to do them first. But when I plan, I usually just put work first because this is my catch-all planner. So work goes first and I tell myself, this is what time I'm working today. I just go ahead and put my work schedule. And then I might, before I leave work, I always cook dinner for Emmanuel and I put it in the refrigerator so that when he gets home off the bus, he has dinner. Because if dinner is not prepared, he will literally call me and say, I'm hungry. Um, if anyone doesn't know, my son is autistic. He's 14. He will literally burn the house the house down. So I'm trying to teach him how to cook, but that's not going well. So if y'all have any tips on, I don't know, how to help me teach him how to cook, I'm all ears. So um, one sad thing that happened, um, my sister's, my stepsister's mom passed away like two weeks, two, three, three weeks ago. And I ended up for the weekend going to, taking off time from work, going to the funeral. So I'm just kind of like, okay, the weekend was like extremely sad, you know, and I never saw my sister cry before like that, but it was just extremely sad. And it always hurts when I see people pass away. So I was able to see my grandmother. And as you can see, I wrote Saturday on here because I noticed when I start filming that I missed a heart. So I ended up just hand lettering Saturday and writing the small things that I did on Saturday. So which was, I went to see my grandma, I haven't saw her, I think in a couple years to be honest. And I really just enjoy my family time with her. I wanna thank you for coming back to my YouTube channel. Thank you for watching. Make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe, and Check me out on Instagram. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.